Well, Senator. President Trump is now planning to send up 15,000 U.S. troops to the Mexico border. The reason? To confront migrant caravans headed north towards the U.S. Governor Ducey said today he's concerned about border safety and the pictures he's seeing from the caravan. Team 12 political insider Bram Resnick has more on the governor's comments. Bram? Yeah, a week ago, Governor Ducey claimed the border was, quote, wide open and unprotected. His comments today about the caravan, much milder than that. President Donald Trump told reporters he would send up to 15,000 soldiers to the southwest border. That's about equal to the number of Border Patrol agents already stationed there. These migrants, still about 800 miles away in southern Mexico, are weeks away from arriving at the southwest border. Now, after celebrating Halloween today with patients at Phoenix Children's Hospital, the governor told reporters he was concerned about border safety and troubled by the sight of the caravans. I will say that the pictures uh, of, of the caravan, they, they, they trouble me uh, and, and they concern me. And Why do they governor. trouble you? Well, well all, you have, all, all you have to do is you. look at the pictures and, and I think it would trouble a, a, anyone. And the pictures uh, yes. of the families, that's all we got. Pictures, well, is that the well, of the children and parents? Uh, from a number of perspectives, the pictures trouble me. And the governor wouldn't be more specific about what troubles him in those caravans of largely women and children. The state has 600 National Guard troops already stationed at the border, helping the Border Patrol with support tasks. Now, according to news reports, the soldiers deployed by President Trump will include armed units that could deter the migrants from continuing their long trek to the U.S. border. Live in the Alert Center.